Anita's guide to simple and easy cooking. I'm Anita and today I will show you how to make rice flour laddu. So let's get started. I've got here one cup of rice flour, quarter teaspoon of cardamom powder, two tablespoons of ghee, quarter cup of milk powder, three quarter cup of full cream milk, half a cup of powdered sugar or you can add it according to your taste, quarter cup of desiccated coconut, two tablespoons of chopped cashew nuts, two tablespoons of chopped almonds, two teaspoons spoons of sesame seeds, two tablespoons of chopped pistachios and one teaspoon of ghee for frying the nuts. Nuts and sesame seeds are optional. If you do not eat them, then you can leave them out. Take a non-stick fry pan, put it on medium heat, add one teaspoon of ghee and heat it. Add almonds, cashews, pistachios and sesame seeds. Fry it for one minute, stirring it continuously. Turn the heat off and take it out in a dish. Wipe the fry pan with a tea towel, put it on medium heat again, add rice flour and roast it for 8 minutes, stirring it continuously. After 8 minutes, lower the heat, add desiccated coconut, Continue stirring it and cook it for 2 minutes. After 2 minutes, add milk powder, milk and ghee. Mix it well to combine and cook it for 2 minutes, breaking up any lumps using the back of your spoon or a spatula. Add powdered sugar. Mix it well to combine and cook it for 2 minutes. Add cardamom powder. Give it a mix. Turn the heat off. Cover it and let it rest for 5 minutes. After 5 minutes, transfer the mixture into a plate. Add chopped nuts and mix it well. Take about 2 tablespoons of the mixture in your palm. Press it firmly with your fingers. Use both palms to roll it into a round shape and put it in a dish. Repeat this process. My rice flour laddu is ready and you can make it and serve it to family and friends. Leftover laddu can be kept in a sealed container on the bench top for two weeks or in the fridge for up to one month. Enjoy. If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. For more of my simple and easy recipes, please subscribe to my channel and don't forget to press the bell icon to receive notifications of my latest videos.